they were at Halloween Horror Night and at Universal Studios Hollywood. Uh, I've done about half of the mazes already. Uh, one disappointing, one pretty good, and one really good. That would be Walking Dead was the really good one. Uh, I'm going to climb up the stairs because I don't want to wait for all these people going up. So the lower lock got super crowded just now. Uh, Walking Dead is now, is now 110 minutes. Uh, that's the most crowded maze right now, and I'm, and from what I can tell, upper lot is actually really light right now. Um, sorry, these stairs are killer. Um, Terror Tram, the sign that for Terror Tram, you know, the sign that tells you how long everything is. That Terror Tram's only 20 minutes, and that. Uh, Halloween is only uh, 40. That's not half bad, actually. Kind of give you a visualize of where all the mazes are. Okay, by Jurassic, they're right on the side. If you go up those stairs where a lot of people usually take pictures. That's where Insidious is. It's actually kind of crazy how it works. So, that's weird. find where I am. Okay, so then you cross over this bridge over to the other side. And then the queue is actually in the dino play area for the little kids. Then it goes all the way around to the overflow queue for Jurassic. And then there's a huge tent back there. Walking Dead, let me just find where I am here. It's really dark, it's hard to see. Walking Dead is just behind the mummy building right here. It's hard to see. Um, well, it's actually right on the side of, uh, Transformers. It's on the side of Transformers. Alien vs. Predators, way out there. You have to take a tram down there to get to it. Um, see the glowing red right there? That is, uh, this is the N3D. That was a pretty cool, that was a pretty cool maze. Uh, it was, the capacity was terrible though. It took forever. They said 35 minutes, it took probably at least an hour. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna head up to Terror Tram now. Okay. I'm about to do Terror Tram. These views are amazing from up here at night. It's hard, I can't really see, but that's uh, Harry Potter over there. Ooh, there's a light flicking on that. I don't know if you can see it. Welcome to the Los Angeles Studio Hollywood's first annual Bridge Party Welcome. We have a night of fun to descend under the stars and some fabulous fun events planned for you tonight. Are you ready for some patriotic sing-alongs? Yes! Who's ready for some arts and crafts? Bunnies, kitties, and rainbows, yes! We have it all here tonight. Nothing but good, clean, family fun. It's a wholesome night. The Purge Party is a safe, family-friendly alternative to purging by our new family followers of America. Did you enjoy the party? How are the arts and crafts? Did you make a macaroni necklace? That's my favorite one, personally. Was there fabulous fun down there, guys? Oh, here are my patriotic friends. I love the stripes. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Universal Studios Hollywood's first annual perch party. Yes, our new family followers of America have given us this wonderful opportunity 
What did that say? That said 40 minutes, so like... Knowing the regular studio tour, this is actually not a long way. This shouldn't be long at all. This may not even be 20 minutes. Assuming it runs like the regular tram, it shouldn't be that long. I have Jill, our Purge party planner, broadcasting right now. Thank you for that fabulous introduction. You're welcome. Hello, everyone. My name is Jill St. Stevens, and it's my pleasure to welcome you to Universal's first annual Purge party. Yeah. You know, Universal Studios has long been a proud supporter of the Purge and our new founding fathers. I see some of you brought your children today. Fabulous. You're going to enjoy tonight. We have fabulous food, games, arts and crafts, and patriotic sing-alongs planned for you. Sounds a lot better than being locked up in the house all night with mom and dad, doesn't it? Fabulous. Now, before we begin, tour guide, can you give me your current location? Locked and loaded and on roof. <laughs> I'm sorry, we lied to you. Shame on we and woe to me. As you see, tonight is about something else. Tonight is about purging the scum of our nation. Which, my unfortunate friends, you are. Because you run and hide rather than hunt. And so, hunted you shall be. You make a mockery of our blessed 28th Amendment and our glorious purge, and that shall not be. We have family and friends, good patriotic people, who are willing to pay good money for the right to purge you disgusting scum, whether it be in private in one of our luxurious kill rooms, or out in the open on the hunting grounds. And if by some manner you survive all that, you still won't get by Big Daddy and his men. That I can assure you. But now it's time to release the beast and let the purging commence. Blessed be our new founding fathers and America, a nation reborn. Universal Studios backlog, where we have great food, fabulous 
themes and prizes, arts and crafts, patriotic sing-alongs, and absolutely no violence in any part. The Jabberwockies is going on. I'm gonna because that's probably taken away from all of the heat from. Um, love how I said heat and that went on, but um, heat from uh, Halloween, and that's my that's the maze I'm looking most forward to because that is a classic movie. I love that movie. Nowadays, I mean, yeah, it's pretty cheesy, but I still love it. So I I can't wait to try this out to see. If, this is probably going to be the scariest one. I mean, Michael Myers, he's, he's terrifying. Can't wait to try this out. I got out of that scares and I can explain what just happened. I just went in Halloween. That was the best, most scariest maze I've ever been in. That was by far the best thing I've ever done at Halloween. Okay, this maze, this maze is brilliant. This is the best maze I've ever been in, by far. Unbelievable. This is, even if you just did this maze, it'd be worth the admission price. It's that good. as their battleground, based on the 20th Century Fox film franchise that brought together the two most iconic brands in the horror science fiction genre, Alien and Predators. Whoever wins, he wins. All right, guys, we are headed to our destination drop-off on the back lot. You're gonna want to make sure you have all of your personal belongings and, oh, hold on. This is not a test. This is your emergency broadcast system announcing the commencement of the annual purge sanctioned by the U.S. government. I totally forgot tonight is the purge! I'm so sorry, ladies and gentlemen, but you're going to have to disembark the tram and take your chances on the city streets. Yeah. Only one person is yeah. about that. Just remember... All the good the perch does. Blessed be America, a nation reborn. Bye bye now. You're now in the back lot of Universal Studios. Uh, I just went through the scare zone, which is the purge. And that's Crimson Peak. I could I could care less about Crimson Peak now. It's Alien versus Predator. Twenty-five minutes, let's go.
So I did all the mazes here at Halloween Horror Nights. No front of the line. I don't think it was necessary except for like a couple mazes. But yeah, it was pretty good. They are seated toward the center of the row. If you have an emergency of any kind, just pull the emergency cord located overhead and I'll be back to assist you as soon as it is safe to do so. Right now we are headed back to the park where you can experience the rest of Halloween Horror Nights. On the lower lot of the theme park where we'll be dropping you off, we have three new mazes for you to experience. Take a look at your screens. The Walking Dead, Wolves Not Farm, the most watched show in cable TV history, returns to Halloween Horror Nights with the largest maze ever. Inspired by season five of the popular AMC series, follow in the footsteps of the human survivors on the show as you try to survive a terrifying world where the living can be just as dangerous as the dead. This is the end of 3D. Today is your lucky day. You've been invited to attend a party at James Franco's house. Unfortunately, the apocalypse occurs before you can make it to the party. And now, you're trapped in a life and death struggle with all the forces of evil. Will you be raptured up to heaven or be damned for all time? Insidious, return to the further. A haunting journey into the paranormal based on all three chapters of the Insidious Saga. A new threat has crossed over from the dark realm known as the Further into ours. To face this new threat, we are going to have to confront the demons where they live. We are going to have to return to the Further.
That concludes Horror Nights for 2015, opening night. So now I'm in front of The Simpsons, it's a lot quieter up here. So now I can actually talk for once. So I think Horror Nights this year was great. Is it the best Halloween event? No, I still think Knots and Magic Mountain do top it. Um, but the the Halloween and AVP were pretty cool. Uh, even the Simpsons area is pretty cool. They played the Treehouse of Horror music. Love it. It's very nice. So I'm gonna try to get out of here. If you want to see um, the full reviews of all the mazes. Uh, go to greatamericancoaster.co. I will have the full review up. I wanted to do Halloween again, but since it's like right as you're exiting the park, I think everyone had that same idea. It's 65 minutes right now, and it's almost 2 o'clock in the morning. I feel bad for the people who have to work like till three or four because of that maze. Okay, now to finish off with the last scare zone. The scare zone is exterminators or something like that, I don't know. That's the Harry Potter world going up next. And oh in spring I guess. It's it's almost done really. Got, that used to be Pink's Hot Dogs, hence why they have that there. Everything's starting to close up because. Let me see what time it is. I'm trying to get my phone out. Two minutes to two. Is there a one? Oh my god, there's no one for all in Is there? Oh, wait, yeah, there is. There's a huge one. Never mind. Just entering and exiting the park, you'll get scared. Chainsaws are love, chainsaws are life. Give it a rest, man. We've already done the maze. 